Hey, this is Jay of DeFi Journey. Gonna run through a quick tutorial on how to use DYDX and how to place a trade. So stick with me, we're just gonna make this real quick. So first off, you go to DYDX.exchange and we're gonna trade on V4 because that has the most offering for incentives with the DYDX token. And also it is for all change using the new DYDX chain. So we're gonna hit continue. We're gonna acknowledge this statement and you will not be able to use DYDX if you are a person in the U.S. and whatever banned countries. So do what you will with that information. Um, now we have all these markets here. So you can go up to here and we got ETH, Bitcoin, Sol, whatever you want to use. So right now ETH is the most popular with volume, Bitcoin pretty close. So I'll show you how to connect. So. Um, you will need a MetaMask, most likely. There's other wallets, but most people have MetaMask. So we will do that. So let's do Connect Wallet, and I'm going to do MetaMask. Going to sign the transaction. There's no fee for that. Let's request. Going to sign it, and there we go. And so now you have connected here. You can see balance, and you can do the bridging. There's I have another video, which I'll link at the bottom, or I'll put it right there, and where you can see how to fund your account. But all right, so now we are wanting to place a trade. And so where we are in the, kind of in the market cycle and hype, I'm wanting to place a long. So we've had a little bit of a pullback to here on Bitcoin, um, but I'm wanting a long. The trend is up and we've retested these lows here. So I'm looking to put in a long. So let's do, let's just go a market buy right now to kind of get us in. So right now, see we're at 66,238. So let's do 0 0.001. So right there would be about 66 bucks and I'll put a little bit of leverage. So let's do, let's do five. Uh, yeah, let's, let's do 10 X leverage. How about that? Do 10 X leverage. And we are going to, and you can see right here, our margin views, and we are going to place order. Now here we got our orders in. And so now I'm going to show you, uh, it's really nice. You see the entry point and where, where we're at. So now I'm going to put in a stop loss. So we're here to stop limit. And see right here, but if we go below, close below like these wicks here, I'm not gonna like that. So let's do 65, let's do 65,350. So we'll do 65,350, same thing, 65,350. And you wanna put in what we're at. So right now we have 0 0.0168, 0 0.0168. And there we go. we're going to oh, we'll put it as a cell, I'm sorry. So, and then we will, place the stop limit. So we're going to put that in place stop limit and there we go. And so then you can see it on here. Stop limit is set right there. It's really like, and we're going to go one step further. We are going to put a take profit price so that we can just see that. So you don't have to check it all. So if I say I want to, if I think we're going to retest these highs, so let's, let's go up here. Let's just do six, seven, 500. So we're going to do take profit limit. Six seven five hundred. There, six seven five hundred. And same thing of what the amount is. So we're at point oh one six eight. And oh, I didn't say this earlier. So good time. Like, I'm just wanting to keep this open for. I'm not gonna hold this long for a while. So I, I'm just gonna put it as one day. But same thing. You can always close it beforehand. So I'm gonna put take profit limit. It's gonna be for one day. And there we go. So there you see right here, we have the entry price and we are actually up a little bit. See the green line? This will refresh in a little bit. That's how you place a trade and you can set your, your limit orders there. So, um, but hey, thanks for checking us out. Um, please give me a comment, like the video if you enjoyed it, um, subscribe, but please leave me, leave me a comment. Let me know what you liked, what other content you wanna see about trading uh, I did like to do lots of DEXs and stuff within Cosmos, um, doing some other L2s. But um, yeah, please subscribe. See you in the next one.